end. This evening, we meet five wrestlers hoping to get to grips with a gold medal. We sent our own Mr Muscle, Chris Hall, to try and pin them down. Well, a sport of wrestling dates back to the ancient Egyptians, but in modern times, two northwest towns have become masters of the mat. I'm from Bolton. I'm from Wigan. From Bolton. From Wigan. Bolton. Of England's nine freestyle wrestlers heading to Delhi, five are from those two towns alone. Wrestling's a very hard sport, um, and I like to think, I think the northwest, you know, northerners have got that true grit. Uh, they can stick it. A lot of people walk into a wrestling club, can't hack it and walk off, but there's something about the northwest and people from the northwest, I think, that uh, you know that true grit that makes them stick at it and keep training hard. Are people surprised though when you speak to them and you say what you do? Yeah, they obviously expect me to be a lot bigger and like a lot more manly or whatever, but you have to explain it's a lot more like judo and not how they think it is. The most famous Lancastrian wrestler of recent times was the late David Smith, otherwise known as the British Bulldog. Yeah, I'm Wigan born, Wigan bred, Wigan built. But the star-spangled slammers of the WWE provide more stigma than inspiration. Because it's not uh, televised that much and uh, there's not that much exposure, it was all like that through school. Like They all started asking me, like, oh, do you have too much steel chairs? Throw them over the top rope and that. For Wiganers especially, flying out to India today does have a major drawback. A bit this much, I'm not going to be able to go to Old Trafford and watch the grand final with it being Wigan and St Helens especially. Uh, but hopefully we'll have Sky Sports in India. He'll have to twist their arm. Facilities in the athlete's village sound basic, but to wrestlers, sacrifice is nothing new. I've had to give up a lot. Like I've got a son at home and a girlfriend and I've had to um, kind of leave them for months on end and go and train in Russia to make sure I get to this, this place. So it'd be massive for me to get a medal and take home to my son and let him see that and obviously let him take it in school and stuff. So will they grapple to the gold? We could be set for a few wrestlers' nights. Chris Hall, Granada Reports, Manchester. Yeah, see what he did there? Wrestlers' yeah, nights, yeah. Very, very clever. Wrestlers' yeah. nights, no. Chris Hall, genius. Okay, now every Tuesday,